Charlie was a very fun, bubbly and outgoing person. He always lit up the room, attracting all the attention and constantly cracking jokes. We were lucky to have each other. We were nine years old when we lost our mum to cancer. Charlie wouldn't talk about it as much as I did. He withdrew inside himself. It was only in the last year of Charlie's life that I realised he was struggling. I put this down to his workload and pressures at university. This was the first point in our lives where we weren't with each other all the time. I wasn't able to look after him like I had always done. I remember I was in the library preparing my dissertation and I saw our dad walk in. I knew that something wasn't right, but I didn't expect it to be Charlie. I felt like I had lost my right arm. It was the worst feeling of my life. Dad and I decided that we needed to make something of this rather than let the opportunity go by. We wanted to make a difference to this ever-growing problem of suicide in young people. So we decided to set up the Charlie Watkins Foundation. We've teamed up with the charity Mind to create an online chat room that students can access when they need support. We've named this Chat with Charlie. This will initially be trialled at the University of Essex. Our dream is to provide this online service to all universities across the country. If one person feels safe, then this has been a success. Don't underestimate that the people closest to you might need your support. Even if it's just a chat. One in four of us will experience some form of mental health problem in our lifetime. Help us make a difference. To donate or volunteer your time, visit our website.